What is going on guys? I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media back with another Dokkan battle video and I'm gonna be straight up with you today We're on the JP version of the game to try to pull some LRs for some context My luck on global recently has been absolutely awful. I can't pull an LR to save my life I am literally at this point over 600 stones on the LR Goku and Frieza banner and I haven't pulled a single hype unit let alone an LR in over 600 stones my most hype pull at the moment is a physical Rebrian. So today I decided to pop into my JP account, which you guys know I don't play a ton. And I noticed I have a crazy amount of stones in my box. Well, I already picked them up, so I have 213 now, but I had like five before. So I had over 200 stones in my box completely free and a solid amount of tickets. So we're gonna spend all of them in today's video and hopefully pull at least one LR and break that dry spell we've had. Also right now, um, just you know, as a side note, it might be a good idea to start re-rolling on JP if you want to. Well, actually on both versions. We should be getting over 200 stones with a re-roll account at the moment. So if you wanna re-roll a solid account with like one or two LRs or maybe the AGL Goku or Frieza or Tech Frieza, then it might be a good time. But that's a side note. Um, yeah, so that's what we're doing today. Let's jump into it. Actually, <laughs> there's one thing I'm curious about. I noticed that some people, this is like whole meme that's been going around where people are changing their names to major YouTubers like Nanogenics or Rhyme Style or uh, Zenrodo is one of them too. I actually don't know who he is, but apparently he was an older like YouTuber from back in the day. But yeah, I'm kind of curious about it because <laughs> some people have been sending me screenshots and they're like, yo, it works and like, I've been pulling fire ever since I changed my name, so we're gonna change our name to Nanogenics right now, see how far that gets us, and then, you know, if, if we don't pull fire with this name, maybe we'll change to Rhyme Style in a second or something else, but <laughs> I don't necessarily believe it, but it is fun, so let's just try to try it out, you know, you never know what could happen, you never know what could happen. Um, oh, just one last thing before I, I want to talk about before I get started is that I just started a Discord server with my boys. Oh, the Hermanity AC Gaming and D Prof Gaming. So I'll put a link in the description down below. So click that invite link if you want to come and just hang out with us and chat with us and just have a lot of fun. And that's it, guys. Let's jump into these LR summons. We got four multis on this banner and then I think about 60 tickets on the ticket banner. So let's pull an LR today. Come on. <clears throat> if at any point in this video you guys want to join with me and do a group summon, we got a we got a Vegeta. That's that's promising. That's promising right there. Come on. He trans- no, he went Super Saiyan. <sighs> Yo, I was hoping for like an absolutely hype, hype like Vegito transformation right off the bat. <laughs> it's been really hard guys, man. It's been really, really hard on J uh, on Global these days. I just- the luck has been absolutely awful, man. I just can't pull anything. No matter how many stones I try to drop into that banner, the LR Goku- oh, the banner we're something on right now on the Global version. It's just- it's not happening. It's not happening and it's not helping that- Everyone I know, literally every single person that I know personally who plays Dokkan has been pulling absolute fire on this banner. I have this little chat um, with a few of my friends that play Dokkan and every single person on in that group <laughs> has pulled at least one LR on this banner within a pretty reasonable amount of stones, like 300 or less. And uh, I, I believe like three or four of them already pulled the LR Goku and Frieza as well. So. It's just rough, man. It's, it's rough being that one guy. <laughs> that one guy that can't pull anything. Okay, we got, uh, I think Yamcha and Gohan. I meant Super Saiyan. That's not a, that's not like a, you know, like a trio or whatever. It's not like a special featured or anything like that. It's just a random collection of people. Um, but it doesn't mean anything, right? We could still get some fire. One of my friends, Joe, he, or Deep Prof Gaming, he actually pulled two LRs and one multi on Goku flying solo. So... <laughs> At the end of the day, it doesn't really mean anything. Like, you could get a guaranteed, like, Vegito, Gogeta. Ooh! Ooh! Okay! Yo, I'll take that! I'll take that! Yo, I, I just realized she's actually... I, I just remember she's actually in the unfeatured pool, right? She's, she's like Kefla in a way where she like she's not a Dokkan Fest unit, but she's still really, really good. So that was probably one of the best non Dokkan Fest units I could have pulled. Yo, that's sick. Okay, okay, that's sick. Lux turning around a little bit. I'm really, really happy with that. <laughs> I don't know if I can actually build a team around her because my characters are a little bit limited on this account, but you know, we'll see, we'll see, man. I'll, I'll absolutely take it. Um, I, I might have, I might have Rosé. I might have SDR Rosé, so I can maybe just build like a villains team with her. But yo, know, that's dope, man. That's dope. That's a good start. Okay, no LR yet, but we got, we got the base. So, 
Yeah, that's cool too, man. That's cool. Okay, two more multis. Let's pull the LR, please. Let's, let's, let's pull the LR, Goku, and Frieza. That's all I want. Honestly, at this point, I will take any LR, though. Like, I'm not about to be choosy. I'm not about to be picky, but... If I had a choice, LR, Goku, and Frieza is definitely the one I'm gunning for, man. <sighs> Let me know in the comments down below how your guys, or how your luck has been these days. Um, like I said, mine has been really, really bad, but I know a lot of people have been pulling fire, so I would love to hear your stories about what kind of absolute fire you've been pulling these days. And also, let me know your opinions on the whole, you know, Super Shenron debacle, the debacle, debacle, <laughs> debacle, debacle, debacle. No, that's a hard word to say. But you know, the whole thing with the Super Shenron, where we like kind of got a wish, you know, last night, but not really a wish. The 50 stones plus a bunch of things. Um, and I know some people are upset about it. I'm personally pretty satisfied with it because I feel like, you know, it's actually not a bad reward for. Here's the thing. We got 40 stones and a bunch of stuff for you know, just collecting all 7 Dragon Balls, right? And then we got the extra 50 stones and some other stuff on top of it. Horrible multi, by the way. Let's just not even talk about it. We're going to forget about it now. But um, after the 40 stones initially, they actually had like no... They didn't have to. They didn't have to give us anything extra because there was no mention of a wish in the news when it first came out. And, you know, anything on top of that, if they did, if, you know, when they did decide to give us something extra, that was just like a bonus, man. That wasn't like something that we were really, you know, I was hoping for a uh, Super Saiyan God, um, we were really guaranteed. So, I just feel like at the end of the day, man, people, they had, ooh, Dispo, Dispo, alright, couldn't pull Dispo on Global, couldn't pull Dispo on Global in over 600 stones. Dispo was actually the one I wanted the most on that banner, other than the LR. So at least we got Dispo now. At least we got Dispo. At least we got the Android 21. So, yo, these summons have already been way more fire. <laughs> in in the 200 stones, already way more fire than my by my uh, global summons, right? So I, I would say like it's still successful so far. Even if we don't pull an LR, if we, even if we don't pull an LR on the ticket banner, it's still a success. I'm still winning over global right now on JP. Um, now I forgot what I was saying. Damn. <laughs> this is what happens. Like I get some pulls and I'm talking to you guys and then I just completely lose my train of thought. Um, wow, we got this guy twice. Okay. Alright. Overall, not bad summons. I'm going to lock this bow up right there. Uh, oh, I, I remember now. So basically, like people just had way too crazy expectations of what the... Um, actual like Super Shenron thing was going to be, man. Because I, I know a lot of people were gunning for things like, you know, a free LR, like some kind of stone to give us a free LR, or like 300 stones, because that's like a whole meme in itself, but like people were like, oh, maybe we'll get 300 stones finally, oh, Super Saiyan 3, Super Saiyan 3, so we got that guaranteed uh, SSR in this multi, sweet. I really want UI Goku on this account, I obviously would love a LR as well, but... You know, I'm not expecting that to happen necessarily, but UI Goku would be great, Super Saiyan 3 Bardock would be awesome. Um, and this guy... <laughs> I mean, he's not the best, not the best this is our full, but I'll take him, you know? It could have been a total shaft as well, so... Yo, any, any SSR we can pull on this banner, they're free SSRs, so... Yeah, I'll take it, lock him up, I'm pretty sure that's the only copy I have on this account as well. Like I said, pretty bare account, so anything I... Anything I get, is a good chance it's gonna be new. Uh... Oh, no, I thought that was like a special group right there, but it wasn't. Um, yeah, some people were like, yo, you, someone even told me, yo, we're going to get the entire story reset so that we can refarm all of it over again. And guys, that's like over, oh, Strength Gogeta, didn't have him, all right. Um, that's like over 600 stones or something like that. I, I, don't, I don't remember exactly. Ooh, um, Int Pycon too. Yo, I don't have this guy. Obviously, he's SDR on Global, but I don't have him on Global uh, at all, so, yo, okay, my JP account's, like, making up for all the stuff I didn't have on J on Global, um, but yeah, man, yo, it's, it's just, like, that, I don't remember exactly how many, but that's, like, over 600 stones, I believe, and why would they do that, man, why would they do that, it's just crazy, that's crazy, yo, and also, I, uh, there's one more I heard that's even more crazy, it was, like, they will refund all the stones that we spent during the 250 million dollar celebration, <laughs> because it's kind of, like, how... Uh, Super Shenron in the anime brought back all the universes that got erased, right? So it's kind of like, our stones are the universes that got erased, you know, we wasted those stones, and then now Super Shenron's gonna bring all of them back as our wish. 
<laughs> Which, man, I, I would have been awesome. Like, all, all those things, I would have totally, totally welcomed. Trust me, man. I am I'm a Dokkan player, too, just like you guys. You know, I'm not. I don't work for Bandai. I don't, like, have any insider information or anything like that. So, you know, I'm with you guys. I really would love all those insane rewards. But, like, let's be real, man. This is Bandai we're talking about. And not even just, you know, Bandai being Bandai being cheap, right? It's any company that makes these gacha games... They need to make money, right? They're a business, they know how to make money, and they're not just going to be giving tons of random crap away to their player base. I mean, there's a certain extent where like they'll give away free stuff to keep us happy, but they're not going to go overboard with it where like they're going to, you know, lose money on like with people potentially summoning or like buying stones or things like that, right? And, you know, that in context and the fact that like honestly they didn't have to give us wishes, um I think, it, like, the rewards are pretty solid, man. Like, we got 90 stones in total. You know, the 40 from collecting the stone, from collecting the Dragon Balls, and 50 just, like, as a bonus on top of that. Oh, go to and Trunks. Featured unit. UI Goku. Let's go. Come on, come on. Give me a UI Goku. SSJ3 Bardock. Uh, is Super Saiyan Blue Evolution Vegeta on this banner? I, I didn't check. Uh, uh, maybe? Maybe? I don't know. But yeah, like, just all those things put into context. It's kind of like really really good man what we got uh physical physical broly don't really need him but yo i'll take it whatever um but yeah man like <laughs> this is what i'm just trying to tell people like th this is just what's been on my mind i think that the expectations were definitely way way too high going in and you know anything anything that was gonna happen was probably gonna be a letdown just because of how crazy the expectations were and yeah, like, I get it, man. Like, I, I get why people feel that way and everything, but... <sighs> no, I just, I just can't, I, I just can't agree with it. And, like, no, like, I'm, I'm, like, I'm not saying your opinion is wrong if you, if you are disappointed. And, I, I, like, I totally understand. It's totally cool, but it's just, it's just not how I feel. It's not how I feel. All right. I still got a couple tickets left. We got a screen crack, so we're going to get an SSR and this multi. Uh, tickets, tickets summons have been... Ooh. Ooh, that's new. That's new. I, I'm pretty sure that's new. All right, that's a good pull. That's a good pull right there. Um... But yeah, overall, like these tickets have been okay. I I I think they're okay. Like I can't pull an LR to save my life. The streak continues on <laughs> on JP. Unless you know, in the, in these last 19 tickets, we pull something nice. We got a Gohan and a Krillin. Yo, why isn't the family family Kamehameha trio a special animation, right? Like why don't we have um, Goku flying with Gohan and Goten? And then when you pull down, like just those three. You pull down, they do the family Kamehameha together as opposed to just Goku doing the Kamehameha. How absolutely fire would that be, man? Like, I don't know why they didn't implement it. It's just such an obvious thing. Because in the past, I think I've seen Gohan and um, Goten with Goku. And I'm like, yo, that's totally, that should be an animation, right? There's all these, like, iconic duels, like, you know, Gohan and, um, Gohan and, no, 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 what is it? Tr no, what am I trying to say? Goku and Krillin, you know, that's like a special thing, and uh, you know, Yamcha and Tien, and Piccolo and Gohan, but why isn't the family Kamehameha trio a thing? It's Goku and his sons. That should be totally, that should totally be a guaranteed, at least featured unit, if not like a guaranteed LR or something, right? Because that's like, that's like a really iconic thing that everybody who watches Dragon Ball recognizes, the family Kamehameha, right? So, I don't know. I don't know what they were thinking when they didn't implement that, but that should be 100% be a thing, man. And, uh, you know what else should also be a thing? <laughs> Me pulling at least one LR in, like, what is it now? It's... So I did just 200 here, about 650 on global. We're at 850 stones deep without an LR on both versions combined. And I know, man, I don't, I shouldn't expect LRs, you know, they're not guaranteed. LRs are never guaranteed, but, like, just with the current rates now, with how many LRs there are in the game, as uh, in addition to um, the GSSR mechanic, those two combined make it a lot easier, like way, way easier to pull LRs these days, and I still can't do it. And I'm not saying that the rates are awesome now, but like when you're around people who just can't stop pulling LRs, it hurts a little bit, it hurts a little bit. Oh, yo, last night when we got those 50 free stones on global, of course I did immediately did a multi on the LR Goku and Frieza banner because I haven't given up yet. I'm, 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 I, I pretty much told myself that I'm just gonna keep trying until I either the banner goes away or I pull the LR Goku and Frieza because that's how bad I want them. This, this is 
you know, one of the only times as of recent memory that I've chased a unit like this just because of how amazing they are. And um, I just really want this LR, man. So I did a multi, got just the GSSR, and it was a useless physical Sin Shenron because I have had that guy rainbowed for time. So I can't use him for anything. And then my girl decides to do a multi, um, number 18, Taya. She decided to do a multi on the physical banner, the physical type banner that just dropped. And she pulled, she got a Vegito animation, Super Vegito animation, pulled LR Trunks. <laughs> Uh, that's her fourth summonable LR, I think. That's Yeah, that's her fourth summonable LR because she has LR Gogeta, LR Vegito, LR Super Saiyan 3 Goku with a dupe, and now LR Trunks. And she's completely free to play. She's been playing for literally, uh, what is it, like two months maybe? Maybe three months at most. But three, like, three months at most, free to play, has LR Super Saiyan 3 Goku with a dupe, and all these other... Um, just fire units, man. Her, her, her account is absolutely fire for a free-to-play unit. You guys should see it sometime. But yeah, that's enough talking. I'm not complaining. I still love her. I still love my friends, too, who are pulling LRs. I still love you guys who are pulling LRs as well. This is going to be the final summon of the video. I'm going to count down from three, and we're going to do a group summon together. I doubt it's going to be anything, but hopefully I can transfer some luck to you guys and allow you to pull fire um, just for watching me and supporting me and all those things. All right, guys. Group summon. Get ready. Take your phones out. Take your devices out. We're going to summon in 3, 2, 1. Let it rip. At least we got a Super Saiyan. At least that's a SR guaranteed. Wait, this is, a, this is probably an SR guaranteed banner, isn't it? Probably. I don't, <laughs> I don't know. I haven't been paying. Oh! Okay. We ended off the group summon. We ended off the summons with an SSR pull. Sure, it's not the greatest SSR, but Physical Goku Black is actually pretty solid. Don't sleep on him, and he's also going to be great for my villains team, coupled with that Android 21 that I pulled earlier on. So you know what? I'll take him. I'm absolutely happy. We still couldn't pull an LR on JP, but at the very least, we pulled some nice units. You know, my JP account's looking a little bit nicer. I'm not going to complain about it. At this, at this point, like with the LR luck, I'm just used to it, man. I'm just completely used to it. Let's see... Um, I don't even know what character list is. Is this character list? That's team. What is, is this character list? No, that's Awaken. Uh, man, this thing is so confusing, man. Okay, uh, character list. There we go. All right. So that's acquired. We're gonna go to SSR. And we pulled 12 SSRs. One, two, three. Maybe four here. Oh, like at least three that are worth getting hyped about. And yo, I just remember that JP also got this awesome Frieza, so yo, I'm, I'm happy about that. I'll take that. Well, that's it, guys. The Nanogenics thing didn't work, unfortunately. <laughs> it didn't help us pull an LR, but if you guys did change your name to Nano or Rhyme and managed to pull LRs, congratulations. Let me know in the comments down below about your stories of, of success and all those things. And I hope you guys enjoyed the video, man. It was a lot of fun to make. And uh, hopefully I'll be back on JP in the near future to do some more content from the JP side of the game because you guys know that I'm, well most of you that have been following me at least know that I am mostly global focused but I do plan to expand that to JP in the near future and just kind of play both sides or maybe at some point slowly transition to JP so I can be up to date with all the newest stuff. I, yo, global players, don't don't get scared. Like if I do do that, I'll, I will still be playing both sides so it's not like I need to completely forget about you guys. But uh, that's something I've been thinking about. We'll have to see what I do in the near future. But that's all for today's video. Remember, if you guys like the video, make sure to like the damn video. And if it's your first time watching me and you like what you see, then make sure to hit that big red subscribe button to join the Tiger Squad now. And also hit that notification bell if you haven't yet so that YouTube knows you guys want to see all my latest content. But that's all from me today. Hope you have a fantastic day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media, signing out.